With this video tutorial, you will learn how to knit this easy mesh stitch. To work this stitch pattern, cast on multiples of 2 and add 2 stitches for the 8 stitches if needed. The pattern repeat is 2 stitches on a row and only 1 row. That means that all right side rows and wrong side rows are worked the same. Which makes the stitch pattern very easy to remember. The only stitches you need to know is how to knit 2 together and do yarn overs. This mesh looks completely the same from both sides. This is the right side and this is the reverse side. Let's begin knitting. Here I cast on 20 stitches. Two stitches, the first one and the last one are the 8 stitches. The mesh will be made on 18 stitches. Begin knitting row 1, right side. Slip the first H stitch purlwise, then do yarn over and knit the next two stitches together into the front leg. Then repeat yarn over and knit the next two stitches together. Again yarn over, knit two together, yarn over, knit two together. Continue in this way till the end of this row. Yarn over, knit the next two stitches together. Again, yarn over, knit two together, yarn over, knit two together, and the last time, yarn over, knit the next two stitches together, and purl the last H stitch to complete the row. The first row is ready. Turn to work the second row. Work the exact same way as the first row. So to begin, slip the first H stitch purlwise, then yarn over and knit the next two stitches together, the stitch and the yarn over. Knit into the front leg. Then again, repeat yarn over, knit two together, yarn over, knit two together. Keep repeating the same till the end of the row. Yarn over, knit two together, yarn over, knit two together. and continue in this way. Yarn over, knit the next two stitches together, yarn over, knit two together, and now purl the last H stitch to complete the row. The second row is made. Now turn and repeat the same row as many times as needed for your mesh. Keep working until you've reached the desired length. Here I made several more rows just to show you the texture of the mesh. This easy to crochet pattern is great for shawls, rubs, scarves and tops. I remind you that to start with this stitch pattern you need to cast on multiples of 2 and add 2 more stitches for the 8 stitches. The pattern repeat is 2 stitches in a row and only 1 row. All right side rows and wrong side rows are worked the same. This is the right side of my swatch. And from the back it looks completely the same.
Thank you so much for watching and please subscribe to our channel for more tutorials.